Got your back against the wall, no, you know you never had a chance. Should've known better, now you better make other players. There's no going back, gotta let you know in advance. This is Game Squad. Come on down to Truly Urban Hobby Shop, located at 2391 Grand Concourse in the Bronx, New York, for all your Yu-Gi-Oh! needs. Thank you, and enjoy the rest of the video. How's it going, YouTube? This is Joe Grizz from the Team Avalanche Worldwide YouTube channel. I'm here with my boy Malcolm Dominguez, and he's going to give me a profile on Amorphages. Why you like Amorphages, bro? Because it's a whole anti-meta deck built into monsters. Do you think it's gonna be the next big thing in the format? I'm hoping for it. Man. Hoping for it? Alright, we'll get into it. Right. <laughs> we all are. <laughs> we all are. All these niggas. All these niggas. All these niggas. Hollywood. This nigga. Ray. <laughs> the Revolution. <What>? And Marco. <laughs> Go ahead. So, we play one luster because we need the effect to pop. But yeah. me personally, I don't ever like really playing him in the pendulum zone. I'd rather use him <clears throat> to actually summon one of the. Like one of these three, because they get better effects than that. You play two rescue hamsters, because mm -hmm. this summon effect, I didn't really think about it. My boy Ray did, so. But this summon effect is actually really good for any of the monsters that are level four, because it only works for monsters that are level five or lower. So you get the special two from your deck, and it allows you to overlay into anything that you might need. You can use the pendulum effect maybe once ever, but you're never really gonna use that. Two maxis, mm -hmm. it's obvious. Three literary. And I was crazy to say. This one negates spell cards. They all have the same maintenance cards that you gotta tribute a monster or destroy the card. And they all have the same effect text when there's pendulum summon or or flip face up, you cannot uh, special from the extra deck, neither player. This one they get spell cards and their effects. I personally play one uh, Gluttony. He's a skill drain. He negates all monsters and their effects. Yeah. The reason why I only play one is because he level two, so you can't really do much with him, and you're only gonna need him like one match, two match at most, depending on what you're going against. I play two slaws because he's a mistake, and when I I just Thunder normally King, when I Thunder King, nigga. He, all right Thunder King. Normally what I use him for is to tribute summon so that I can pull off the effects of all the spells and traps. Three greed. I need him more for the scale, not his effect. He negates trap cards. So all the all the number continue. So he's Jinzo. Yeah. Not negates. Oh, activation. Negate, it's, not, it's not like Roy Decree. Negate the, they, they the effect. Act. Negate the effect of, of all face-up trap cards because they cannot activate their effects. Yeah, yeah. And the opponent, now the player can activate cards, that, uh, trap cards that are face down, or face up, or in the grave, or anywhere. Uh, three pride, like I, like I said, we only use them because like the level matters. Like these are level four. This one says you take no effect damage, but he got the highest attack of all of them so far. This nigga's fucking broken. This nigga's massive restrict. He, like, he shuts down monarchs by himself. Massive restrict. Wrath. Uh, wrath. And I played three Goliath. I'm thinking of cutting it to two, but for now, he's a macro cosmos. The reason why we, we like him but don't like him is because he's level eight, so... To have to tribute two monsters means you don't get much out of it. Now, I'm gonna do the traps because there's only three of them, so. Three Lysis. All of these cards are Aromages. The, the only one that's not Aromage is Amorphages. Aromages. <laughs> my, my bad. The, the only one that's not Amorph Amorphage is this, is, and I don't know why, Ask Konami. So, this one says if any of them in your scale gets destroyed, Tag it into another one. All your opponent's monsters lose a hundred attack for each attack and defense for each amorphage card face up on the board. One ignite reload. It's kind of obvious why. Like we don't have pot of, we don't have upstarts anymore, so we need speed. I played two amorphous. 
Persona. 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 Spanish. And, and one terraforming. Like I, instead of playing just three of these, like this will thin the deck in comparison. Um, all your um amorphage monsters gain 300 attack and defense. Twice per turn, if you tribute amorphage monsters, you draw one card for each set of cards you tribute. And um, if this is in your graveyard, you can special the ritual monster. Two pendulum storm because it'll trigger the the trap card, and it gives you a free pop. Three or more phage infect infection. All of them gain. All your monsters gain a hundred attack for every a more phage card on the board. And whenever you tribute or destroy or anything happens to one of your monsters where they get sent to the graveyard by not being sent. You add one from your deck to your grave, from your deck to your hand. Two MSTs, cause like when you against your monarch matchup, it's only single cards that stop you, like um, the field card, domain, um, and um, like if they're playing vanities or some shit like that. Two dark holes and right gecky. No, no, emptiness, emptiness. Oh, my bad. You, you know what I mean, though, right? Yeah. <laughs> and I, I play all three because these trigger my my spell, my spell cards, and this I got to clear my opponent's board because, obviously, I got to maintain board presence. And this is the only, these are the only three cards in your extra deck. That's all player preference. You can use whatever it is you choose, but I feel like these are the most effective cards because... But they won't come out that often, though. So that's the reason why you only play these three. So yeah, bro, that's my deck profile on the morphine. Hey, and that's Marco Dominguez. You will for, never see for, him play that a tournament. Yeah. Never seen him play that a tournament. You're definitely about to see me in Jersey with you. This girl's going to be a Jersey with you. And as always, you have the right to life, liberty, and the pursuit of you, Gil. Definitely not. Later, guys. Please stay connected with me by adding me on all my social networks on Twitter, Instagram, and Facebook. Just copy the link into your search bar and add. Thank you.